item number SCP-2365. Index. The universe is trying to tell you that it hates you. Object class. Euclid. Special containment procedures. Reports of SCP-2365 are to be investigated and data analyzed for evidence of connections or common factors between victims. Survivors of SCP-2365 and witnesses are to be interviewed, tested, and amnesticized. Foundation front companies are to conduct sleep studies in an attempt to observe and document SCP-2365. While it is not known whether SCP-2365 is mimetic in nature, access to information relating to SCP-2365 is to be restricted. Description SCP-2365 is a phenomenon affecting certain individuals during REM sleep. Initial stages of SCP-2365 are characterized by the materialization of small flakes of rust in the air above the speaker and a reduction in local temperature. Recordings during this stage have detected the noise of metal hinges, the source of which has not been determined. If the sleeper is woken during this stage, no further effects are observed. If SCP-2365 is permitted to progress, the initial phenomena will cease and the second stage will commence. Heavy steel springs will materialize in the space adjacent to the sleeper's head. Over the course of 10 through 15 minutes, this will be followed by the slow manifestation of additional metal attachments, forming a large bear trap. The bear trap will remain suspended over the sleeper's head for up to 10 minutes before slowly dematerializing. If the sleeper returns to consciousness during this period, or contact is made with the trap by the sleeper or others, the springs will be triggered, typically leading to significant trauma to the head and neck. The Foundation's understanding of SCP-2365 is based largely on forensics and witness reports. Observation and testing has been restricted to bear traps which have been triggered and retain material substance, and to a limited number of SCP-2365 survivors. No pattern has been determined between the identities of victims of SCP-2365, and the number of unobserved cases is difficult to determine.